Hello everybody, it's Mystic and welcome back to my library. This is episode 10 of Let's Play Planet Zoo and I have some very stressed little red pandas here and I think I might have a solution for it at least until I get one-way glass which I don't have right now um, but I do think we're researching it. Let me just double check that. Pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. No. Wait. Why are we not researching it? What? Okay. Hang on. We're going to fix that. Let's, um, let's have one of them research barriers. By the way, you might hear my puppy chewing on her bone. Um, I've put some peanut butter in it, so she is quite happy with it at the moment. But, um, for the meantime, I did some research and I think, um, I found a possible solution for this in, um, on, uh, whatchamacallit, on Steam. So I want to see if I can get it to work. Now, I don't think I'm going to need to replace this, but what I want to do is I want to actually cover this part of the shelter so that they can't see the people watching them. And then they can enter from the side here. And then they just have a little bit more privacy. Um, although I might need to just close some of this down or... Well, I don't know. Let's see. Hang on. Let's, um, let me try something. We're going to put up some walls. I think that's what I need to do. Um, I, let me get some wood. Do I not have the right kind of wood walls? Really? All right. I don't know what kind. Oh, no, wait. I'm not in the right, well, I'm not in the right place, but I don't think they would show up anyway. So we're not going to have very matchy walls. Or I can just get rid of this and put a different shelter in, one that has a back to it and just have it face the back of the barrier so that they're not actually seeing all the people watching them let's let's give that a shot um we're gonna try that instead so we'll go to habitat we will search for species we gotta go down to red panda and i'm gonna do the same thing for the bongos because they're the other ones that are constantly stressed and i want to see if it works but i think i'm just gonna test it with um these guys first oh wait a minute there isn't a shelter. Okay, so hang on. We're going to try it this way then. Or I could put a bunch of bamboo there. Will bamboo work? How are we doing on plant coverage in this? Um, oh, yeah. You know what? Let's try bamboo. Let's uh, let's do that. So um, I should probably just... Is this bamboo? What kind of bamboo is that? Bengal? Okay. Yeah, I mean, this might work. Just provide some extra coverage. I, okay, first of all, let's stop doing that. All right, we're going to do that and just really cover this side of it up. And then maybe a little bit more here. Now, there's nothing on that side, so that should be okay. Let's see if that helps with their stress levels. I already got a panda inside. So we'll see if that helps. Otherwise, I might have to take out some of the windows and see if that helps. Uh, but let's see. Why are you all going... Oh. Okay, <laughs> I hate when the game does that. All right. Is that going to help? Well, it's going up. But why? Why would it be going up now? If they're like right in front of everybody. I mean, we could see if this is going to work. But yeah, basically, I just need to wait for the right, the right wind, the right glass, and it should help. I want to see what happens if they, you know, once they go into their little shelter over here and see if that works. I mean, the other option is to make like some sort of a, a cave shelter. Now, see, this one, this one's still getting stressed. I want them to go inside their habitat and see if that helps. Go inside your habitat. I know, I know, you're, you're dropping. You're dropping in in stress. I'm just going to watch them for a minute and see what happens. But right now they're kind of eating, so it might take a minute. But I'm wondering if that's going to help. Otherwise, I might need to put some sort of a wall there to cover the shelter. What was that? Please be barriers. Yes, but it's not the one I need because it's all the way at the end. Uh, so now we have chain steel posts, which honestly, I never use it. 
Um, the only one that honestly is worth it is the one-way glass. Can you please go to the other side of your shelter and so I can see if this works? Hi. Hello. Hey, Ginja! I've known Ginja for ever. Like, since I was in high school, which has been a very long time. <laughs> so cool! She was visiting my zoo! That's pretty awesome. All right. Staff facilities. Okay, so I'm can, I can upgrade those. Yeah, and by the way, I bought cheetahs for the um, Breed the Cheetahs um, franchise mode community goal thing. And I didn't participate in it at all for this zoo. I actually did participate in it with my other zoo. And I actually ended up getting a chimpanzee, I think. Let me see. I think it was a chimpanzee. Yeah, I have a chimpanzee. Which I should probably put in one of my zoos. I, I've never had chimps before, so that's pretty cool. And it's a pretty good one. So, we'll want to do that at some point. And now I need to get zebras. I don't think I have zebras in this zoo. So, this would actually be a pretty good... Well, yeah, this would be a pretty good spot for zebras. They don't need a ton of room. I think that would work. But we're still trying to figure out how to fix this. Are they inside the shelter? They are. And they're still stressed? Oh, no, wait. It's the bongos now. Okay, so wait. Are they... Okay, see? Be... Okay, so covering the shelter, having it face the other way, and covering it seems to be a good course of action. So now... I need to fix the bongos because the bongos are always having all sorts of problems. And this one's going to be an easy fix. I just have to turn this around. Right? Can they still see people? Should I raise? Okay. Let's try this. We're going to, we're going to rotate this, uh, like this. Wait, should I try a different, let me try a different shelter for them. Hang on. Uh, what are my options for bongos? Because this has a wall here, and I'm wondering if that's part of the pro- Or not a wall, a window. Bongo. Yeah. I don't think there's one without a window, unfortunately. Not yet, anyway. Um, and also, part of it is sticking out. What did I do when I made this? All right. So I have a couple of ways to possibly, potentially fix this. First of all, we're going to raise the height- of the barrier. I know I don't really need to for this species, but I think they can see over the barrier, which might be part of the problem, honestly. Now they can't see anybody through that window. We're going to move this. Oh God, what have I done? All right, stop. All right, so we're going to move this. We're going to rotate it there. Now, nobody can see them. It's nice and covered. I want to see if that helps. Are there... Oh, God. Okay. Let's see if that helps. I think it's helping. It's going up. I think it's helping. Yeah, so if they can't see people, they should... Are you stuck? <laughs> Are you stuck in a tree? Okay, there we go. I think we're good. I think we might be okay. Yeah, their stress levels are going back to normal. The only one that's still stressed is the baby, but that should get fixed in a second. Yeah. Okay, I think we might have fixed it. So, hooray for... where? I don't, where did I see it? Reddit? The steam boards? I don't know. I read it somewhere. And whoever suggested turning the, uh, the shelter around is correct. That seems to work. Also, hiding some of the, those spots with plants seems to work. So, I think we're okay now. The bongos can't see anyone, which is good. I mean, they can see them here. But that won't be the case for long. So people are going to just have to whine at me that they can't see the bongos for now. I'd rather have grumpy guests than super stressed out bongos. Now, 
Um, I do want to put zebras in. And actually, maybe this would be a good spot for them. No, I still think that the zebras would fit over here. And we would just have them be viewable from the front. Yeah. All right. Well, how much room do zebras need? I think it'll be fine, though. So let's see. Plain zebras. Plain zebras. Okay. Near threat. 510. Yeah, no. I think that would be fine. Because these guys have plenty of space here, right? How big is this? 1250? Yeah. We'll be fine. Okay. So I'm going to build another habitat here. And then we're going to put the zebras there. Now I have to breed them. This isn't released to the wild, right? That was the cheetahs. Uh, by the way, why is it starting at zero and then having stuff in the background? Like, and then having stuff in the back for the negatives? Like, you can't put a baby zebra back inside its mother. How, <laughs> how does that work? But um, anyway... Let's uh let's make this habitat. What do what do the zebras need? Just grade two? Okay. So they can pretty much have the same exact type of habitat that I built for the cheetahs. And uh we'll just start here. Let's get curved because curved makes everything look nicer. Oops. Uh hold up. Nope, too short. Why are you like this? Alright, hang on. Let's back it up a little bit and we'll go from there. Oh, okay, there we go. It's going to be kind of funny looking, but look, I'm uh, I'm not the greatest at building things. I don't know if this is actually going to be big enough. It, it might not. Well, no, it should be okay. Let's just get... A door and I'm actually gonna have it linked to the staff path right there how big is this 944 yes yeah, see that's a little small mm. and is that gonna bother the animals like that wind turbine I don't think so but it's just animal welfare oh well I can't actually yeah, see, it is within range of the animals. Maybe I need to put them somewhere else. I don't know if I want to keep the zebras here. I might I might put a different species here. Or maybe even, like, an exhibit center. I think the zebras might fit better over here. Yeah, I could put something else over here. Um, alright, so... Paths. Well, no, first I should make the... I should make the habitat. How do I want to do this? Like that. Now, unfortunately, I can't have a path going out that way, at least until I get the solar panels. But when I get a solar panel, it'll be fine. And yes, I know my layout is terrible. I still, I don't know. I feel like as time goes on, I can make stuff look better. But for now, it's fine. All right, whoops. Um, okay, so now I'm going to put some glass. Oh, I don't like this little ridge here. I kind of want to fix that. Barrier. Okay, that's a little better. I mean, it's huge, but it's fine. Okay, so we're just going to put... We're going to keep this, the keeper hut closer to the staff path. How big is this? I think it's huge, actually. Yeah, this is fine for zebras. Um, all right. So, now we need some glass. And, oh, duh. Edit barrier. I'm going to put it along... Uh, this side here. I think that'll be fine for now, actually. I don't even need to make another path for the moment. I think we'll be okay with that. Okay, so what else do I need to do? Habitat. 
And all right, let's put it in plain zebras. There we go. And I don't recall the zebras ever getting stressed in my other zoo, but I can't remember if I ended up getting them after I had one way glass. I don't remember. I think they'll be okay though. I don't recall ever seeing zebras getting stressed. Okay, let's put some of this in. Here we go. And what else? We gotta get some food and water. Food trial. Get a large one. I might end up having multiple zebras, so it's fine. Okay, so we actually already have some stuff from some of the other species that we have, so that's good. Get a grazing ball, toys, got a scent marker, a rubbing pillar, one of these doohickeys. Okay. Uh, I think that should be good for now. Oh yeah, and I ended up getting tons of conservation credits from my offline zoo. So we're good on that for a while too. Why do you have low... Okay, well, I'll deal with the, gorz the gorzillas. Gorillas in a minute. Let me just get some plain zebras in here. <laughs> there we go. Oh, wow. There's lots of them available for cash right now. But I have so much concert... So much... So many conservation credits that I don't really need to do that right now. He's pretty good. We'll get him. Come on. Aw, poops. All right. Well, that's what happens. I don't... Oh, well, I'm not going to get a zero fertility one. Uh, yeah, I'd rather use my conservation credits. I have enough of it. I forgot that every time I do... Although, actually, it seems okay today. I'm not dropping as many frames as I usually do. I wonder if they fix that. Hopefully. I just, I mean, I don't mind getting one that's not great quality. I just need them to not be zero right here. He's okay. He's okay. Zero for till. Gosh, darn it. Come on. Why am I not clicking? There we go. Got one. And he's okay, too. Let me click it. Why are you no click? There we go. Okay. Oh, shoot. I got two males. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Darn it. Okay. I'm going to have to sell one of them. All right. Well, hang on. Who's the better of the two? Hello. Let me click you. I mean... Probably this one, even though he's got the 25, he's got 283. So let's just resell him. Um, how much did I buy him for? I don't remember. We'll just do 325 because I think that's what it was. One of them was. All right, so we got that. Now I need to try and get a female. You know what? I'm just going to use money, providing this one doesn't stink. Hello, let me click things. Hmm. Ugh. Oh, come on with the zero fertility. How is that going to help me? She's old, of course. What do we got? I should really just search for females. Make my life a lot easier. Yeah, let's do that. You know what I never understood? Why does it tell me, it gives me a warning that they have low fertility if they have 17% fertility, but if they have 0% fertility, and I don't get the warning. I don't, I don't get it. Ugh, 33%, still not great. Okay, this one's not bad. Yeah, I don't want to spend that much, but again, I have enough. I have enough conservation credits right now, so 
whatever, let's change this to zebras. And then I need to get a new keeper, I think. I don't think I have a spare. Do I have a spare? I do not. Okay, so let's hire a keeper for them. And then I need to get a work zone. New work zone. Okay, so keeper. And then you need a keeper hut. That's quarantine. Wait, shouldn't I have a bigger keeper hut over here? Hmm. I should get a bigger keeper hut. Hang on. I don't know why I didn't do that before. Of course, now my whole layout is all messed up, but whatever. We'll just move it to this side. And then I think I have to rearrange some uh, work zones. All right, keeper hut, large. I don't know why I don't have all these paths connected. Probably would make it easier for these people, wouldn't it? There. Do I need to? I don't know. That's not going to work. All right, well, fine. Those are all connected. Okay, so, hmm. I need to make sure all of the work zones have a keeper HUD. But first and foremost, let me do this one. Is this the one I just started using? Yeah, okay. We'll do this. Keeper hut large. And then the staff room. Zebras. Zebra keeper. Okay. And then I need a vet. Well, no, wait. Um, who, which, that's gorillas, right? Grizzly and gorilla. They need... Yeah, they need a new keeper hut. Oh no, wait, that's vet. Duh. All right, hang on. Zebra keeper, snake exhibits. They should have a keeper hut, right? No? Well, now you do. Okay. And then Red Panda should have a keeper hut, but they don't have a staff room, so I gotta fix that. Okay. And then Peafowl. Nothing is... they don't have staff rooms. Why didn't I put staff rooms? Grizzlies. Do not have anything. Let's get them something. Keeper hut. Staff room. Gorillas have Animal Trade Center. What the heck was I doing when I did this? All right. Keeper Hut Large and Staff Rooms. Okay. That was Gorillas. Cheetahs should be all set. Yeah. Cheetahs, Bongos. They need a, they need a staff room. Okay. Is that everything? Oh. There goes my phone. Don't know what that was. Um, okay. I think the keepers or the caretakers and the mechanics should be okay. I just need to possibly... No, I don't think I need to fix... Yeah, I don't need to fix the vets. I think the vets should be okay. Oh, but I do need to add a vet for... We'll do the cheetahs. They can be cheetahs and zebras. There. Okay. I think that should be okay. If something seems off, I'll fix it later. Who has low... You're stressed. You too? And not enough space. Oh, wait. They were having an issue... With the climbing, and I'm still not sure why. But let's let's try something. 
Let's try something. I think I just I think I just got some new climbing stuff for them. Plan zebra. Now we need to get the species, the western lowland gorilla. Climbing. No, I don't have any new climbing stuff. I still don't know why it's not working. All right, let's see if that works. Keep... Oh, for Pete's sake. All right. Pause. Is that... I don't... I don't know why my climbing is not working. There's clearly climbing here. There's also trees, so... Like, they're literally <laughs> using it, but it's not working. Um... I, I don't understand why it's not working. It went up by 3.8. That still doesn't make any sense. Seven point five. It really doesn't make any sense. I might need to move this. I don't have this trouble in my other zoo. All right, well, the stress is gone. I keep hitting spacebar to pause because I've been playing Crusader Kings 2 and that's how you do it, but <laughs> it doesn't work in this game. Maybe I need more trees? Oh, maybe I need more trees. Wait, what the heck is this? Broken white birch. Maybe they won't use that. Is that the problem? It says it's for them, but maybe it's not for them. Okay, maybe I need to just put a bunch of these things. I mean, how many of these do I need? Maybe I, okay, well, I, can, I can't really deal with that right now. Let's, um, let's try to put more trees in and see if that helps. Nature, what is this? Africa and tropical. Oops, wrong thing. I am. Okay. Mangrove tree. I don't know if this will help for climbing, but we're going to try. Oh my gosh. And they go back in there. Is it helping? I'm not sure because they're back in a box. No, why aren't trees counting? Shouldn't they be? Hmm. What's wrong with your space? Insufficient area. That's not the case. It's they're they're complaining because they're cla they're claiming there's not enough climbing space. But there is. Now what? Oh no. I tried to fix this. Oh no wait. I mean it's not that bad. Are they back inside here? Where are you? Where's my where's the stressed one? Who am I looking at? Is it gonna go up in here though? Do I need to raise the walls, maybe? 
Maybe I need to raise the walls. Let's let's try that. I will figure this out. Yeah, maybe they're not tall enough because some people are pretty tall, right? Well, wait, I don't know. How tall is two meters? <laughs> no, most people's heads aren't going over this, but maybe that's part of the problem. Let's just uh, let's try that. I don't know. Either that or I have to build a better habit, a better shelter for them. Is it going up? Somebody just went back into a box. <gasps> okay. Retsuko is fine. It's this little dude in here that's stressed. Yeah. Did I ever end up getting my um, zebras? Yes. I got one of them. Where's the other one? Where's my other zebra? In the trade center for some reason. Okay. I can't click on the button today. Why? Okay. Alright. What? Eastern brown snake and cheetah. Okay. Um... All right, let's try plan two. Let's get rid of this. I might put it back up, but let me try something. They want privacy, right? So let's try this. Construction. And I don't have the right walls, but we'll just use this. Um, actually, wait. Edit? Yeah, I should probably do it that way. Don't know if this is going to help, but I'm going to try it. Okay, exit. Are you good now? There it goes. Space. What do you mean? Are you stuck? <laughs> I can't win! Alright. Alright. You good? Space. Zero. Why? There we go. Okay. I think he was stuck. We got plenty of plants. Now he's got privacy. Maybe we're okay now? Oh no, now what? Let me guess. Stressed! <laughs> okay. Yeah, well, that, that makes sense. They don't have a lot of privacy here at all. Um, but they also don't want a lot of plants. So, let me do exactly what I did with the pandas and put a wall up. There. Give them some privacy. See if that helps. Nobody can see you now. Seriously, I promise. There they, there it goes. Well, no. Hmm. How are you? It is going up, but... How, you're good? Yeah, it's going up. As long as that wall is there, we should be fine. Okay. So I have figured this out. You need a wall by the shelter to just give them some privacy. I need better shelters. I don't have them. Uh, do I? Hang on. I might have actually gotten a better shelter. Species cheetah. Shelters. See, what I need is I need more shelters like this. No, not even like that. I need shelters with a back to them. But that does seem to be helping. Okay, so we need food enrichment for them. Which I still don't have. Okay. 
I'm working on it. Oh, we've got some peafowl that are about to be born. I did get a request to name some of the white ones Ice and Snow. So if we end up getting some white peacocks, we will... I don't think we have any new... Oh, well, we just got one. I'm going to I'm going to wait. I'm not going to name anybody until I know who I'm keeping. Oh, they're all white. Look at all these little white babies. Okay, hang on. Oh, he's he's decent. Okay, you guys got to separate a little bit so I can see. Man, we are researching the heck out of eastern brown snakes. Okay, everybody has separated. Now I can see Zara, Syra, Akshara, mm, decent, Mahika. I know there was another one. There was a little boy. Where'd he go? Did he skedaddle that quickly? Or is this him over here? How did he get there so quick? I don't know who I'm going to keep yet, actually. Akshara. Yeah, she's got 291. She might be the one to keep. Pretty sure. Yeah, we're gonna have we're gonna keep her. Okay, so we will name her Snow. There we go. Okay. I think we finally got our stress issues fixed. Whoa! Fixed. Maybe. Possibly. I still have to do something with the chimpanzee too, but I think I Oh! You know what I didn't do? I didn't uh I didn't put any donation boxes or anything in here. Let's do that. That would be helpful. Okay, then we just need some of these. And a couple of these. Okay. Zebra. Oops. Zebra. Zebra. Okay. That should be everything. Oh, and I need to research them. Although all of my vets are currently busy. Although no, somebody is researching the red pandas. They don't need to do that. Although is she the person that's over by the red pandas? Because now she's running all over the zoo. Well, I'll see if that stresses her out. If it does, I'll fix it. Also, I should probably start working on giving everybody some training, especially the keepers. There. That'll help. Okay. Oh my gosh. We don't have anybody stressed right now. Holy moly. We actually did it. So, yep, good to know. Put a barrier up, or not a barrier, put a wall up, and then they can hide from guests when they don't feel like being viewed. And then once you get one-way glass, it'll be even easier. But yeah, we fixed that. Um, and then I just have to wait for my zebras to breed. Oh, I didn't realize how old she was. She should still be able to get pregnant though. Pretty sure. She's not that old. Let me see. Oh, they have a good chance of getting pregnant, actually, so we should be all right. She's a little on the older side, but not that bad. She's not a senior yet. I've had zebras live another 10 years in my other zoo. Okay. I'll just wait and see if I can uh, get them to have a baby. And then we'll get started on the franchise mode stuff. But I think I'm going to stop here for this episode and I will pick things up in the next one, which I'm going to be recording right after this. So I will actually be able to get some work done on the new franchise community goal thing. 
Um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed. And yeah, I think I finally figured out my stress issues. Knock on wood. We will see. But hopefully you enjoyed. And I will see you next time. Bye.